أنا جوا عبد الحبيب محمد إبراهيم رجال وحا أنكش قيا كأحد حرير كإلكترونيك وزير الدعم المه دبدة مريهنكا وحا من تلك المرتين وجوا تنشرها مريهنكا وفردية أقابل سن أرمها الصومالي جيمس أسوان وأن من تلور سؤال وتكويد ديني تذكر نقل حرير بقية إنترنت كأه فيسبوكه سؤال شو جوه الرئيس وحا إنه وقت سمي محمد إسحاق علي إسحاق أمر كان سؤاله وتكويد ديني يو أي كم تاي صدق حب نضيك كابن تاي سؤال شهر وتكويد ديني وحويان محي تحي وجدة مرقق وكقبة طلقة صومالية سؤال شاسي إن يونو بتشوا بدون الدنشرو سؤال شل بعض وحويا مدام أي ترتول الربا إن الدولة دا فدرال كيا صومالية أي ترتر تكو حدا الشباب حق شركة إن هو كان جستا لقصة مين يا الشعب كا يدلك جودة هامبا أمان كسعداء شيسة محا عن قبطين تهوب كل لوجا قاد ويا وطن كصومالية سؤال شيء الصدحات أو أن هالك اللي نكاخر إنه واحد كم بدأ محيط هاي سبب تكلفتي إن مواطنين ص مواطن صوماليات أو مدحوين أو أردي أو صار شحي شعب كنا بقول كي بس عشان أي وذين أو دورنيين إن أو يهقف كاسنا إن فرماجو أو ضدك إنتو البدن الرجال بيت كدي دنايين أو عقب ضين بدن لوس الرجي إن شعب كدونش دارش دي سو وذينه هالك اللي جوهر استعجي تاسي ما الديمقراطية بكشرة أي هيد سؤاشة وجوه الرئيس أوديه قفقاس. Thank you very much. Thank you for having me here today. The U.S. objectives in Somalia are very much to support the Somali people in what we believe to be their own objectives of improved security, democratic institutions, and economic growth for the benefit of the population. And to that end, we're working very closely. Uh, both with uh, the Somali leadership, with uh, regional neighbors, uh, the African Union, and the United Nations to advance those objectives. With respect to uh, the uh, arms embargo, uh, recently there was a decision by the uh, United Nations uh, Security Council that uh, the uh, embargo on the Somali government, only the Somali government, should be suspended for a period of one year uh, subject to certain safeguards. The purpose uh, of this is indeed to support legitimate efforts by Somali national institutions to rebuild the security forces and create uh, a, a, an improved security sector for the benefit of the Somali population. Finally, with respect to any particular candidates uh, last summer with the transition, of course we and all international partners were uh, very pleased with the impressive progress made by the Somali people in completing the transition uh, last uh, September, uh, ushering in uh, an era of new leadership and uh, supporting uh, the establishment of, of those leaders uh, in their new positions. But at no time were we or other international partners supporting a particular candidate, either for a particular individual or against a particular individual. We supported the process, and we were pleased that at the end of the day, that process produced new Somali leadership. So, I shall about and Waha I know got semi and Abduweli Galait or Kahad or Kundal Buntland Somalia. So, I shall say, I tie we do have we deal her and then she had an ego of what in Somalia or Kundal Buntland. Ahana Kasuchi then I want to cast the Kayb Tassi Somalia. لباطة بدن أي نجوا هاي سا كحدة الشباب المركا وحويدين يا دنشرها محوسو قد بين لها سي أي دولة مرين كوجا تاجر يسو أما محيد دولة مرين كوجا تاجر كسرين يسا دولة بنت لان يا شعب كده بقى لباطة بس اللورد نقال ما كحدة سي أرجع حسدة. All Shabab is clearly a movement that has shown that it is out of touch with the Somali people. And we've seen in recent years a steady and I would argue accelerated erosion of support for al-Shabaab. Why is that? Because al-Shabaab represents a draconian vision of governance, and it represents a view of the future of Somalia that we believe is quite a dark vision in contrast to the genuine aspirations of the Somali people. And so I think what we're seeing with respect to al-Shabaab is that the Somali population itself is turning increasingly against this movement. Certainly, support for uh, AMISOM efforts. The Somali National Army as a key partner for AMISOM have helped roll back al-Shabaab uh, militarily. And we've now seen al-Shabaab lose control of most 
uh, urban areas of the country and all but one port city. And that is already helping to undercut its access to finances and its ability to continue to sustain operations. But our work in Somalia, in cooperation with Somalis, both in the south, in Puntland, and elsewhere, is very much focused on creating a better narrative and an improved prospect for success of the Somali people to counter al-Shabaab. And it's that improved vision, it's that better uh, view of the future of Somalia that ultimately is going to be the margin of victory against al-Shabaab. So I shall stop the hard what I know got to me and Mikhail Jibril or is a kunal Megalada and Mordisha and Gobal Kabanadir. Waha Uri Marenko Sida U what another color or are we and Mhu and what the car Sidebu Marenko Scholar what the car and in Ulaka in Ukapato Somalian Yabio Somalia is a all Shakani and a Somalian Dina Akalena and Oconsoli Somalia Maka Marenko Sidebu Labada C are remote is a good car. وتصويص إيشة صدحات أو نسوي دي إن قفقاسي. Well, the United States and many other international partners uh, certainly uh, have uh, great respect for the efforts that have been made by the Somaliland people uh, over a number of years in terms of maintaining a high degree of stability in the Somaliland territory, in terms of uh, impressive gains on the governance front, including holding a number of elections that have been of a high standard, uh, and certainly also uh, respect uh, efforts that have been made by that population to improve their economy and, and livelihoods. And the U.S. Uh, certainly uh, intends to continue uh, its engagement with uh, the Somaliland population and administration in terms of humanitarian response, in terms of reconstruction and development activities, and in terms of uh, our shared governance agenda. At the same time, the United States uh, position uh, is fully consistent with uh, the United Nations, the African Union, the neighboring countries of Somalia in terms of recognizing uh, the national government uh, in Mogadishu. And uh, in January, uh, President Hassan Sheikh uh, Mohamud visited Washington and there was a formal uh, exchange of uh, notes with uh, then uh, Secretary of State uh, Hillary Clinton that uh, re-established formal U.S. recognition of uh, Somalia uh, for the first time since uh, 1991. So our position is very much consistent with the African Union position, with the U.N. position in terms of recognition of a Somali national government. Yet we also uh, want to continue our engagement and relationship with uh, Somalilanders for the benefit of that population. Thank you, Ambassador. So I shall go down by Sa or Halkan and Usoe DA Abdurazak Malim Omar or Isa Kunal Wadaka Dube Sutaka Imaratka. Where we do when we dine a Marenko, Mahai Somalia, Ugabihimwe, the Mushahar Kaida mother, Galakasi and Somalia, Hadden and Hana for Sandadot, Sida I Ukal may so, the Ulad Pakistan, yet the Ulad Mosser. So Ella has a young queen in a denture, and so Ella Hana Wahin Kachuabi, a denture, and Marenka James as well. Add Badum had some time. Clearly, uh, having a paid and properly sustained uh, national security force is absolutely essential to any government's ability to ensure security within its territory. Uh, we're all familiar with the uh, challenges that uh, the Somali administration has faced over many recent years in terms of asserting that security. So the United States, along with other partners, uh, has been pleased to play a supporting role in assisting the government of Somalia in covering some of the expenses uh, related to its national security forces. Uh, and uh, we certainly look forward to continuing to do that, even while uh, beginning to work uh, yet more actively at transition of those forces to uh, full support by the Somali government itself. Uh, Ambassador uh, James Swan, thank you very much for your time. Thank you very much for having me. Thank you. Sir.